What do you need? Uh, give me something that's gonna make me happy. <laughs> you won't find that here, but I can make you a gin and tonic that'll help you forget. Uh, that'll have to do. And a... I'm waiting for someone. See him again. Put a little extra where the ice would be. Make it two. So. been nursing that a while? Long enough. Vodka? Soda. In your head, you said... Shh. Shh. I wanted us to have a drink together. Huh. Well, I don't... don't normally, anyhow. I, bad chemicals and whatnot. I'm not judging, though. Have at it. I don't recall asking permission. Alrighty, then. What's so bad about chemicals? Nothing in and of themselves. It, it's what it all is, you know? It. Everything, man. Your drink. This table. It's all chemicals. We're all sacks of chemicals, you know? People think that's a little grim. It's simplistic in the extreme. But technically correct, I suppose. Certainly no more grim than any other attempt at a unifying theory I've heard. Actually, it's quite refreshing. Fucking A. That's what I think. <laughs> it's freeing. <laughs> Bags of chemicals, man. All a slightly different mix. All worth tasting. Not enough time to try all the combinations. Nervous? What do you think? So what's your combination, then? If I tell you that, then where's the surprise? Don't worry, man. We're still ingesting liquid together. It's a bonding moment. You married. Wrong finger. Never found the right woman, huh? I just know myself. That's rare. I know myself enough to not do that. The right one, though? I decided a long time ago that I would never regret not experiencing something merely out of some sense of duty to another person. Duty is honorable. Duty is a cage. Self-concocted excuses in which a coward hides himself. It's just an accepted form of self-neutering. Regret not the things you do, but the things you didn't do. Read that on a t-shirt. Mm -hmm. See, 
That sounds to me like the path of least resistance. Sounds like you know your own compulsions, not yourself, and that you let them control you. Our compulsions, our desires, are who we are. They're all anyone is. I don't need to rationalize away the guilt of that fact with a pseudo Nietzschean chemistry lecture. What? I would never want to waste another person's time. Just as I would never want mine wasted. Yeah, I hear you, man. Time's all we got. Some of us. See ya. I think you, like, set yourself a kind of impossible task there. To do the things you don't want to regret not doing means to not do the other choice. To do one thing means to not do another. There's always going to be something you'll end up regretting in the end. No matter what we do, we always die full of regret. I choose the regret that won't actually torment me while I'm alive, when it matters. Uh, the lesser of two evils. Aren't you just a trough of other people's worn out wisdom? See me? I'm always down for the more evil of two evils. And I live with no regret. That's easy enough for a young man to see. It's also bullshit. And if it were true, that you have no regret, that simply means that you've done nothing worthwhile. Taken no risks. It means you are not bold. And that will be the story of you. Not bold. I'm here, aren't I? Yeah, you are. So why'd you stop drinking? Got boring. Predictable man. I crave intense experiences. As soon as something gets old, I gotta leave it behind. Some of us just crave extremes. The whole world craves extremes. In the past two minutes on that television screen back there, they've gone from the genocidal horrors of ISIS to discussions on the shape of Iggy Azalea's ass with equally fervorous attention. <laughs> There's no mid-ground left. The world's fucking bipolar. And I'll tell you another thing. It's been building towards this for a very long time. As civilizations always do before a collapse. You think this is all destined for self-destruction? I don't believe in destiny. I do, however, believe in inevitability. The Hindenburg wasn't destined to crash and explode. But it was always going to happen. You understand what I mean? Gee, you saying that something filled with highly combustible chemicals will eventually explode in the end? That's your theory, kid. If you want something, why wait? That's all I'm getting at. So. So. You ever done anything like this? Have you? I've tried. But they were always too old. Or they turn chicken. Just not fucking show up. Yeah. Old, huh? 
as opposed to Yum. At a certain age, muscles go into decline. The body stops retaining protein. Chemicals. Oh, there it is. Doesn't look like a problem you have. This isn't that sort of thing, kid. Really? Hey, wait, man. Have you done this before? How would that... Show me. Roll up your pant legs. Roll up your pant legs. Do it. Look at me when you do it. Now the other one. Roll up your sleeves. Wait. Take the whole sweater off. bombed out in the court when I was 17. The muscle tore right off the bone. Hey man, I'm not a fucking junkie. I don't drink. Not for a long time anyhow. I don't smoke. I'm a vegetarian. I only eat organic. My junk is as clean as a fucking whistle. Guaranteed. The only scar I got is that one on my arm. Oh, I can see plenty of wounds still bleeding in you, boy. What do you want to hear, man? What'll make you happy here? Hmm? You want to hear that each day I'm alive is harder for me than the last? You want to hear that for three seconds each morning, I'm happy until I realize I'm awake and that I'm me, and then a fucking rage sets in that I have no way of keeping down? You want to hear that the only way I can come is having someone hold a knife to my throat? You want to hear that there's a man painted inside my skull who hisses at me every time I start to feel good about myself. Forgive me. I just want it. Yeah, I know what you wanted. I'm in. Okay? I am in like you're in. You know, I was ready to walk out of here with you without a word. But I think we gotta respect that our reasons for this are our own. And you played yourself right out of the gate. And I know more about you already than I want to. The man who can have anything must get very boring. Things that are easy to own have no value. Then don't be so keen to take the mystery out of it, dude. It's the flavors that you can't quite pin down that make something taste so good. If 
finish your drink, kid. What are you going to start with? You know, I got a lot of replies to my ad. Huh? Yeah. There's a lot of weird little boys out there. None of them are me, though. That's for me to decide. Forgets his first. Come on. Come on. What are you waiting for? <laughs> 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 